Now, Wave 31 Storm Tracker Chief Meteorologist Tanner Knust with 31 Triple Dollar. We have a nice long stretch of warm weather this week, but some rain may be on the way. Yeah, you know, hey. <laughs> a slight chance. Yeah, maybe. I wouldn't hold my breath. Is yeah. basically what I'm saying. Yeah, we'll have a slight chance tomorrow mm -hmm. and on Thursday. Mm -hmm. but Farther you're north, saying there's a chance. Saying there's a chance. Yeah. Farther north you go, the better your possibility. Um, if you want to be play it safe, bring the umbrella with you just in case. But again, I'm not holding my breath that we'll get that moisture that some of us really need after a, a dry stretch we have had here recently. And one thing that's kind of drying things out even more is the uh, warmth that we've seen during a lot of these afternoons recently. Today, the hottest of this entire month so far in Huntsville with an afternoon high of 93 degrees. That was just two degrees shy of today's record high of 95 set back in 2019. The theme we have had recently are some fall like low temperatures. Four straight nights now we've had lows in the 50s and now four straight days with highs in the 90s. So fall like mornings and summer like afternoons has been our theme. Get used to that. That is likely how it's going to go moving forward here the rest of this week and as we kick off October as well. I'm not forecasting 50s tonight. It should be a few degrees warmer tonight than previous nights, and that puts us in the low 60s for most spots. 62 in Scottsboro and Huntsville, 64 the overnight low in Muscle Shoals. It is not going to take long for those numbers to rise tomorrow morning. That's how things have gone recently. Quick morning warm-ups getting us into the mid 80s by the afternoon. I anticipate that we'll stay just shy of 90 in most spots tomorrow, but still it is going to be warmer than average for this time of the year. 31 triple down are showing a lot of ground clutter, but no rain falling over North Alabama this evening. We have a lot of rain around the region across Georgia and Florida. There's been quite a bit of rain today, even southern parts of Alabama, and then a separate system kicking up some showers and storms as far south as Kentucky. We are in between those two systems, small area of high pressure keeping things quiet for the time being. Now that northern system is going to get a little bit closer to us tomorrow and will possibly stir up some strong storms as far south as near Nashville in Tennessee. But there is no threat for severe weather here locally. And as you can see on the map behind me here, the threat for rain in general is pretty low. We're just not in the right position to have the best chance at rain. Better chances in Middle Tennessee than any part of North Alabama to see moisture tomorrow. Here's new future radar data overnight tonight likely to stay dry. Slim chance at a couple pop up showers near DeKalb County overnight during the day tomorrow. The latest future radar data continues to keep us dry. There is a slim chance that some rain in Tennessee drifts our way around dinner time tomorrow, but the latest models have continued to dry us out. So that is likely going to be the situation Thursday. We'll be watching Tennessee again for some daytime showers and isolated storms that could drift our way during the afternoon. This now appears to be our best chance, but once again, I'm not holding my breath that we'll get much moisture out of that and generally speaking, a lot of us are looking at dry weather the next two days and, and, and down the road, a lot of dry weather coming our way the rest of this week and heading into next week as well. After Thursday, I don't have any chance of rain in the extended 10 day forecast and the warmth will keep on going during the afternoons up to 90 again on Saturday. Uh, this upcoming weekend looks like virtually a repeat of last weekend. Again, just kind of waiting for that fall chill to arrive for us here in North <laughs> Alabama. We're going to have to wait a little longer. It's yeah. coming. Maybe several weeks into it before we actually <laughs> see it. very well, yeah. Right.